Where the fuck have I put my phone? Ah, oh, it's... Ah, oh, it's there. <laughs> right. Let's make sure everything's all Gucci. It should be all Gucci. Test. Okay, I think we're good to go. So, back on Black Ops 4. Today, we are doing the Swordfish. This is the final tactical rifle that I need to do. Um, of all the tactical rifles. There is the M16 here, as you can see, but it's a DLC. It has no effect. This came from the Picker Bribe, so no one cares about Picker Bribe unless you're picking the VMP, the most broken gun in the game. So, the Swordfish um, is all I need to do. I've got these camos to do to this stream, so it's quite a lot. But I think we should be able to we should be able to do it all on Nuketown. You can get long shot spots on Nuketown. Um, you can get 50 kills and all these stuff very simply. Um, something I do actually need to be mindful of is if I've unlocked. I do have all the wire cards, of course I do. I'm level 55. I'm not going to prestige because that would be foolish. Um, and yeah, so literally I've got everything set up really. It's super easy to get these done, I think, now that I'm playing on Nuketown only because Nuketown is just sort of like really easy access. It's just super quick and simple to, to do your challenges on. And what I've noticed is recently I've been getting so many bad players that this is making my challenges so fucking quick. On top of the fact that if I actually show you real quick... We've got double XP all around just for the past few days. And I really hope it doesn't go because it's very useful. So I'm just grinding the shit out of uh, hardcore with the double XPs. And it's really doing a huge help. I can't make it up. This shit is like leveling me up so fast that I, I like just after literally prestiging a weapon, I got it to like level 11 in like one or two matches. So it's doing a lot. It's doing more than the average leveling would do. In any other game if you were to put on like double xp so this is doing quite a big deal um it, it's crazy um excuse the ugly camo it does have moving eyes on it it's a bit creepy i gotta be honest but i mean it's animated so that's why i selected it and you know i'm i, I could select one of these but why would i do that come on why would i do that when this one looks better there isn't too many people in my lobby find me a lobby now don't be dumb dumb don't be stinky. Don't be dumb, dumb, stinky. I know you can find me a lobby because I was in one for most of the fucking day. So. Yo, or Joe, he said Joel, hello, Coca-Cola, what's going on? Why does it do this as soon as I start streaming? Why? I had no issues with matchmaking before. Maybe it's because I was just stuck in the same lobby that was just infinitely working. That could be it, to be honest. It could just have been that I was in a lobby that was constantly stopping and finishing. So I never had to worry about not finding one. But I suppose now, because I'm actually, you know, not in that lobby anymore, I can't seem to find it. Where is the chat? Well, it says the messages are received, so I don't know why the chat's not showing anything. Uh, will that do it? No! Don't encode overload, please don't. This is a joke. Come on. There should be a chat on screen, but it's not there for some reason. So I guess we'll try and fix that whilst we're waiting for a match. How? How weird. Owned chat. Um, maybe I should just delete it and then re-put it back in. I'll do that. Okay, tools. Um... Scene collection. Actually, no, add. Add a scene. Owned pro chat. I guess that's what it is. Okay. 
there it is. You should be able to see a black box appear on the screen. That's just loading in the chat. Or maybe you don't. I don't know. Huh. How weird. Right, spam the chat, Rick, right now. Spam the chat and see if it pops up. Because if it doesn't, I'm going to be very disappointed. I'll join in. E, yes, just spam E. Yep, it's appearing. It's appearing. Let's go. I found a lobby. Let's go, baby. It's only got one person in it. Oh, my. Where is everybody in this fucking game? <laughs> Rip. He's a, he's a, he's cut his uh, thing is just rip. I agree, rip. Thank you for giving a stream of ease on my screen. That's beautiful. Thank you. Very epic. <laughs> nice. Oh, okay. We've got some people joining in. See, this is what I mean. There's a lot of new people in here. This, I think this is Prestige 1 or 2. What the fuck is this emblem? What is wrong with people in this game? <laughs> there is some weird people in it. F to pay respect. That's what I do every day. I see the state of Black Ops 4. I play. I, I press F for respect. Oh god, we're not having a conversation again about Joe versus Drump. Jesus Christ. I think you meant Bo. Bo versus Drump. No, it's Tronald Dump. It's Dump, not tr not Drump. It's Dump. Tronald Dump. I swear to God, if I have to look back on my archives one day and I'm just constantly seeing Joe Biden and Donald Trump jokes, uh, <laughs> I'm probably going to lose my mind. I'll be like, where the fuck is the diversity in this concert, in this content? It's just constant Joe Biden, Joe Biden. <laughs> but come on, man. He has... He has... <laughs> dementia. Like... It, it's not funny, but it kind of is because it's because it's Bo Jiden. <sighs> I've been chilling recently. I've had um, I've just been able to chill knowing that I've had videos upon videos just scheduled. So now I'm just sort of sat back playing Black Ops Four. It's pretty epic. Am I going to have to sit here and wait for players for like half an hour? Why is this guy like scratching his mic? I don't know if you can hear it, but it's popping up on the side. The This guy here, Mad Max. I can just hear... Every time he just... Every time it pops up. It's freaking me out. <laughs> I didn't say it. He did. He said it. So... <laughs> Don't, don't attack me. This is not my emblem. <laughs> oh my god. How do I, um... How do I message this guy? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Someone's just like that trying to cancel me, like cancel Zemo. He is uh every fucking list of shit under the fucking sun. Why did he leave? Come on, don't leave the lobby. We need to keep players in here. Do I look like I'm joking right now? No. I am not joking. It's been nearly ten minutes already, and I've not got into a fucking lobby. Oh, here we are. Here are all the players I saw earlier. Oh, he replied, he replied. This is juicy. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, no, no problem, no problem. Ultimate respect. This is this is how the G's, the top G's, have to come together. We have to we have to form an alliance against against. Uh, I'm not gonna say it, but you know what I'm on about. One more player. Come on. I feel like more people are playing Black Ops Four now. Is it just me? Like it it. It's, it's 
like nine o'clock at night, like there sh usually isn't tons of people on. What what was the emblem? Oh, we're not watching. The guy had it's his pro his, his right his emblem literally looked like this, so black and w black with white text, but his emblem basically said fuck, and then it had pride underneath it. So yeah, that's what his emblem was. I've got to be honest, people go a bit haywire with the emblems in this game. Half the time I'm in Black Ops 4, either, well, you see people like this here, which I'm just not going to say that, that's just cringe. But, um, there's people with emblems like that, there's other people with Nazi signs as their emblems. I mean, there's a lot of racists in Call of Duty, I think we know that. I mean, it's kind of something that you'll see in pretty much 90% of OG COD videos, you'll see people just being blatantly racist down the mic, but... You know, I feel like they're hiding. They're hiding in these older games where they can get away with it. Because there's no sort of active developers and shit like, that are actually monitoring the game. So they kind of just get away with it. Whilst, if this was the newer card, and everyone was saying stuff like they're saying in their emblems, they would be getting a lot of backlash. Let's just say that. So, <laughs> yeah. What's this comment? I've got a comment under my video. Right. Personal opinion, of course, but Infinite Warfare's Mastery Camo was way better than Black Ops 3 Dark Matter, had more detail and a better pattern, but that and that's not copying, it's completely different considering they went for a space type camo. True but but Dark Matter just looked better in Black Ops 3, so actually you're wrong. I'm reading a comment by the way, guys, if you don't know. What what the what the cameras I'm doing right now? Okay, two of the, one one of them is really easy. It's just rapid kills. Okay, that should be fairly simple. And one of them's uh, bloodthirsties. I mean, I've been getting bloodthirsties without trying. Like just playing against complete and utter noobs who are literally new to the game. I can easily get bloodthirsty after bloodthirsty every every single match. So th it should actually be a piece of cake. But I think what I'm gonna do first is focus on the most toxic. Wow, he's on the floor. I'm going to focus on the most toxic challenge first, which is the long shots, which actually requires camping around for kills. So let's do that. <clears throat> oh, he's still in there. He's he's still he's still in there. Wow. Um, are you going to get out of that building, or are you just going to sit in there? You're going to fester in there like a parasite. What is he doing? What is he fucking doing up here? Like. Don't play like that. Don't be a buffoon. Right, I need someone to just sit over in the other building. If you guys can protect me, which they cannot hear me because I don't want to have to sit and chat and command people what to do. See, there we go. There's one. Easy. Um, Long shots. Oh, there's another one. Uh, go away! No, I nearly got him. Oh, no. You know, I've been tempted before on my second channel to make a voice impressions video, but I'm not like a comedian and I'm not a voice impression guy, so I wouldn't probably have many to fill the list. And I wouldn't want to set a new standard where people would just be there like asking me to do more because it would probably just be a one-off funny video. But I feel like I can do a perfect Penguin Zero voice impression. Like I've almost mastered it. And, and, and it's weird because I've been able to master a lot of voice impressions over the years. I mean, I used to do, like, the Bowitch impression. You, A lot of you people won't have a clue who that guy is, but there was this kid I was once having beef with back in 2020 and 2019. He used to be my friend for a bit as well. Um, Rick knows exactly who he is, but, you know, Coca-Cola, I should say. But uh, I used to master his impressions as well. I literally embodied the Orn slash Bowitch impression. I, I don't know why. It just it just seems I have the vocal cords that matches any single voice impression. Like, my voice isn't too deep and it's not too squeaky, so I can literally just do squeaky and deep voice impressions. Who was that? What, what bastard was that sending that little seeker mine up here? Come on, show yourself. What was that? Did I just hear an in-game player make a oh, noise? I swear I fucking did. I swear I did. I don't know if I'm hearing shit. That sounded like it was in my ear, but it was extremely distant and quiet. 
Maybe I'm hearing things. Oh my. Maybe it was my player, actually. When my character died, then he made a bit of a weird sound. You know what? I, you know what? I Even though it's 2018 game, and I know no one's going to do it, why don't they just nerf the reactor core? Like, I want to see a dev come into this game after four years and nerf it, because it's, it's ass. The reactor core literally intoxicates everyone in the damn building, and it's terrible. What the f- what happened there? I got blinded? Who's throwing stuns? That's a bit sussy. Ooh! Oh, I forgot the fucking guys over there. Haha, <laughs> I caught- I got a long shot on you even though your little sentry didn't react in time, lol. Oh! Oh, sh shit. I really hate those turrets. They need to get rid of those turrets. They're fucking awful. I mean, they're not going to. It's it's a, it's a completely solid and complete game. They're not going to get rid of it. But it's just, it's just terrible. My hatred for those sentry guns are nothing but immeasurably bad. I... I they're terrible. Oh, my God. See, see what I mean about leveling up? Like, I'm already level 12 on this damn thing. Am I going to have to go over, that pers over here personally and ball stomp this thing to pieces because it's so obnoxious that I'm getting absolutely destroyed by that every time. Hello, buddy. Okay. I'm guessing that's swapping sides, so he should be over here in a minute. I literally recognize these players. Again, there's another guy in here with the same clan tag that has uh, the N-word, but like, shortened. It's always the same people in this damn game. Oh, I can't heal them in hardcore. No. I think you guys are going to like my uh, videos that are coming up. Because, um, well, one of them in particular. Because I, I had the Modern Warfare 2 discussion and Warzone 2.0 video, which went up yesterday at 8. It's kind of clickbaity because I am talking about, oh my god, it's so amazing. Like, as if I've played it. And I'm, I'm actually just playing Modern Warfare 2019 and not Modern Warfare 2. But... Still, I talked about the game. I showed the cutscene, so I mean, it's not all that clickbaity. I never promised that it was going to be a gameplay about it. It was just more like I've seen what it looks like and I've seen the trailers, and it looks hype as fuck. But um, I I have another video scheduled to go up tomorrow, which is just a class setup, bog standard basically for Cold War. And then I've got another video going up the day after, which is me playing in Black Ops 4. And I, this, I recorded this yesterday, by the way. I found a fan. I, I actually found a fan in the game who had an emblem promoting my channel. And I don't know how that happened. Me, of all people. But uh, it happened. So that was pretty interesting. I got a lot of long shots that game. That was a successful match, I must say. Yeah, Nuketown seems to be the best for this, I'm pretty sure. It's just getting me most of the easy dubs. Shut the fuck up, Reddit. I don't even know why I get notifications for Reddit. I don't even care about the damn app. I don't hardly use Reddit. It's obnoxious. I literally just get Reddit notifications because I set an account up for it just to shit on ExoJackal's terrible tattoo photo. I know, I know, I'm creating drama in here by literally speaking about the profound YouTubers I've had beef with, but, you know, it doesn't ever really seem to gather m m many people in here anyway, apart from my mates, so it's just a lovely little ramble. Can he stop eating his mic? Hmm. Well, I have actually done seven of them already. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> that was easy. I've also, I've also maxed this out, the Strife, the first pistol of the few. And that took no effort at all. Its max level is level 10, and it just literally gets through the levels so quickly with this double XP. So that one should be getting gold soon when I do these headshot challenges. But right now, we're focusing on this. We're going to get these diamond... Why is it not loaded in? It looks all meshy. There we go. Diamond tactical rifles. I can't wait to get this done. You know what I'm not looking forward to? Is uh, diamond snipers. Doing snipers for gold is going to be an absolute pain in the ass. Like, imagine trying to play against p 
people were using the Cordite and the VMP in this game with a sniper. Like, it's just not going to end very well. I feel like it's going to be the most obnoxious game experience I'm going to have for the next few months. And meanwhile, there'll be like Modern Warfare 2 dropping in October. So I'll probably get distracted like I did last year when I was trying to do grind Dark Matter. And then next minute, you know, Vanguard dropped with Atomic Grind. So I had to put it aside for a year. So I hate that this grind is all over the place. I really just want to take advantage of these double XP weekends and shit or whatever. I don't even know if they're weekends. They literally last probably a week or something. But I want to take advantage of these double XP moments. And I also want to make sure that... That I can, you know, also play the game whilst it's still got an active player base. I don't want to leave it another year and then I come back and nobody's here. Because then I can't finish the grind. So it's it's all over the place. Um, so it's a bit nerve-wracking trying to finish a camera grind whilst another camera grind is stemming up in another game. But I, I think I'll have it under control. I think things will work out for themselves. Either I'll get tons of weapons done super quickly with this mass leveling up system with double XPs. Or I'll just carry on playing Nuketown anyway and it'll get me easy XP. Someone please go to the window. There was people going to the window before. Now no one's doing it. This kind of sucks. I I think someone's going to come up any minute now. I mean, we're literally on Nuketown, for Christ's sake. If someone doesn't go to that window, I'll be baffled. This guy here trying to pinch my kills, though. Not cool. Not cool. Oh, wow. They're not even on the other side of the map, so what are you doing? Why are you on our side of the map? Look how we still spawn here. This is our side of the map. What are you doing here? Get out of here. You dumbass. You, you're one of those sad virgins fucking using the same diamond guns every damn match. We get it. You have diamond. We don't care. I have diamond on like two free weapon classes now. I don't actually give a shit. Uh, is no one going to go to this window? Or am I the one who has to go to the other window? This reminds me awfully of the long ch shot challenges in Modern Warfare 2019. Where if you were in a certain position, especially with Cold War as well in multiplayer, if you were doing some sniper challenges to get diamond. Because I only did diamond for snipers in Modern War, it wasn't Cold War multiplayer because everything else sucked. And I didn't want to get DM Ultra. But it reminds me of long shot challenges in every pra every, practically every card I have grinded a camo for. Every time you do long shot challenges, you have to stand in the place where other people aren't going to be so that you can take out people where the other people are usually going to be. If you stand in the place where players are usually going to stand, you'll have no luck finding someone to kill in the long shot spot where people normally don't stand at all. So you usually always have to think backwards. In this case, it doesn't look like many people are going to this window this match, so I might actually have to sit in that window and hope that players keep coming up to this room. Because clearly, with us sitting up here... They keep coming up here, so maybe if I let my teammates stay up here as bait, I'll just sit over there and they'll uh, they'll come on over. I, I don't know, but I don't think it'll be worth it because they'll be killing me every five seconds I stand in there because that's literally their side of the map. I am getting no kills right now. This is miserable. Maybe I should do some like long shots from well, not long shots, but you know, gather some five kills without dying from here. Whoa, I got three in one there. Jesus Christ. That's probably contributed to one of the camos. Nice. I, I didn't try, though. I literally just shot, like, one burst of bullets and it killed three people. That is actually insane. I'm not trying to camp, but, you know, I need to for this challenge. These guys really don't like playing camp, and I respect that, but in this case, I really need you to, because I'm trying to do long shots, and I, I really need it. Come on, there's got to be no excuses. They're all over here. Why can't you just... There! Thank you. I need two more, and I'm done with long shots already. See, this is the thing. He's probably going to keep coming back up there now that he knows I'm up here. It's kind of just kind of, uh, what do you say? It's, it's, it's easy psychology, isn't it? It's like, if you kill someone in some place, they're going to keep coming back to try and kill you back for revenge. But in this case, he might try and take me out silently from behind. Who knows? See, there he is again. There's been no one in the window this entire time, but now there suddenly is the same number of people going up there every time. I tell you, I'm telling you, it's definitely him. It's definitely the same guy that was 
there before. There we go. Roller pink camo is all <laughs> polar rink. No, ro it's roller rink, isn't it? I keep forgetting it's roller rink and not roller pink. I, I keep wanting to say it's a rolling pink camo or whatever. Sorry about the camping. It is half time, but forgive me, enemy team. I will actually play the objective this time. Are we in team deathmatch or what? I, I don't know. This chat is dead. Please talk about something epic. What the fuck? <laughs> why do why when I click on your account, uh, Coca Cola, does it just have a? Uh, it just says on your account, Gay Pride. No, uh, no, now it says Nigel Farage. What the hell? Where did your message go? I oh, know I tapped. Oh no, I clicked on your your emoji. I clicked on your emotic emoticon or whatever. Oh, that's what it was. That's kind of cringe. Why would you make an emblem for that in Twitch? Stop making thing, everything inclusive. It's kind of cringy. Ayan Boy is now following. Epic. Very cool. Let me guess, he's someone in my game. I don't know. I don't know how someone in my game would find my Twitch, considering I don't promote my Twitch on Black Ops 4. I promote my YouTube, but I don't know. That's, that's cool. Fair enough. I'll take it. Oh, fuck you. I don't even like Harry Potter, but I'm just humming the song anyway. Come and help, motherfucker. <laughs> I know you're in there. I'm about to squat your sussy balls with my gun. Oh. That kind of sounded sus. There he oh, there's another one. He's trying to take out a uh, air, air vehicle. I think it might be one of our kill streaks. I definitely haven't called anything in, so it'll be one of the sweats on my team. I apologize that they're taking you out with these kill streaks because I don't want them to. I would rather take you guys out and get my bloodthirsties, but you know, it's always gotta be the sweat of my team who ruins my camo grind. It's never it's never the enemy team, it's always the fucking teammates on your own team, which is kind of contradictory if you think about it. You think like, aren't they supposed to help you there that your teammates? But no, they really don't help. If anything, teammates only create balance whereas you don't get like sweated on by so many people at once, but they, they pinch your kills. All they do is pinch your kills. So, I, I can't really say I like my teammates. I'm not expecting them either, though, to be able to let me just do all the kills, because that's not how it works. They're all they're all playing because they want to play the, the damn game. World doesn't revolve around me, but, you know, it, it doesn't matter whether they do it or not. I would just rather not have the teammates there at all. Just... Make my players, all the teammates and my players I'm against, really bad. And then I'll just, it'll just be me versus five noobs. And then that way I can annihilate all of them single-handedly. That would actually be more enjoyable, I think. I'd probably get, like, easier streaks going. Because people would be looking for me actively whilst I don't have to worry about anything. I only have to worry about fending them off. That's free. Uh, it's probably going to be another guy coming up here, isn't there? Oh, yep. Yeah, I was not wrong. I don't even know how I shot him there. I wasn't even looking. I just sprayed and prayed. That is literally... <gasps> there we go. Bloodthirsty. We did one, baby. Let's go. So as I say, I, I really do kind of want to do uh, like um, like a video on my second channel. Just like out of the blue. Like my best <laughs> Penguin Zero impression. Or just a bunch of impressions. But again, I don't want to set a standard where people expect that kind of content from me. Because my second channel... I, I couldn't even describe to you what it is. I don't even have, like, I can't even describe my, my second channel really in a sentence. It would have to be quite a, a bit of writing to explain what my second channel is. It's not like just sec, it's just not just more games. I'd have to say more games outside of Call of Duty, also shit posts, and all the random series that I might start here and there and then quit last minute. Also some game reviews like Minecraft update that I did once at the start of the channel. Maybe a few drama videos. Like, I don't know what it is. My second channel is just like epic. I just dump whatever on there. Hell, I've even dumped music on there too. And one of them accumulated 1.3k views, which is kind of crazy.
So, I mean, I, I literally have the most random second channel. But, you know, it's, it's pretty epic. What the fuck? My teammate, what is wrong with you? Are you brain dead? Where, where's, where's your brains? Did you drop them when you were fucking six? What happened? Your parents don't love you, Max. That sounds weird saying that because I had a friend called Max in high school and I, I'm not talking about him. I'm talking about this weirdo in this game. The one that keeps eating his microphone. He, he keeps going every time he fucking picks it up. Ah! Nope, that's two. No, 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 no. Three. Okay, that's three. I can't heal. I can't heal. I, I'm actually spawn trapping them right now. I'm actually spawn trapping them. These guys are literally just spawning it because I'm the only guy on their side of the map. <gasps> this is kind of wild. Oh, shit, I'm out of ammo. Okay. Reloaded. I will literally get hit right now and I'll be dead. Okay, that's four. Oh, healed. Yes. Five. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, capturing, capturing. Oh, no. The, t the enemies are back. The ops are back at it, boys. One. I told you how easy this is. I literally said to you guys, if you were even here, of course, that streaming on Black Ops 4 now is going to be so much more of a breeze with this double XP. And especially if I can find easier lobbies on, you know, Nuketown Hardcore. Hardcore already gives you, like, easy damage output as it is. Like, you can literally spray someone once without trying and it will literally just kill them. Even if it, even if it just skimmed their armpit, it would fucking kill them in Hardcore. So, I'm getting easy kills. My weapon, my weapon's maxing out level so quick. I mean, literally, I can finish probably gold in like half an hour or more. I mean, we've been half an hour, so actually I'm talking out my ass. But maybe I could finish it in another half an hour. Maybe maybe, maybe two hours minimum. Instead of... What is this? What What is it? What is this? I don't want these guns. What are these guns? I'm running out of the map. I don't know what the fuck I've picked up. I don't want them. How, let me out of the map, please. How do I... <gasps> oh, there we go. I'm out of the map. Holy crap, look at this, guys. Behind the scenes of Nuketown. I never knew that was there. What the hell? There is a windmill there. How have I never noticed that? I just don't pay attention to this map. I, I, I think in my entire time I've been playing Black Ops 4, I've never noticed that. That's kind of wild. Sorry for the, the little tiny bit rate drop in the stream. It does look a bit shitty, like... Oh, God. It looks really pixelated. Ugh. It looked like someone just scrambled the screen up with a whisk and then just, like, shunting them back together again. Ugh. That's kind of epic. I wonder where I got these followers from, because I never really, like, brand my streaming around, and I don't, like, I don't really have many viewers. So it's... I'm surprised. Hmm. Pretty epic. What the fuck is with this guy scrambling his microphone? Stop! <laughs> Hang on, it could have actually been the guy I just messaged before about his emblem. No, it's not. It's not. Never mind. So we completed Roller Rink that game. Uh, oh, I've got seven of these. Should I actually just save these up and see if I can get a pickup bribe? Just like buy the VMP. <laughs> Once I finish Dark Match, I'll be able to become the Elden, uh, the Elden King. The Elden King, like I guess the the Elder. I was gonna say yeah, the Elder. Of Black Ops 4. Every every story of, of a player who's played this game always starts as someone who started playing the game for Dark Matter. Once they finished it, they 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 fell into the subject the the, the submissive trap of Black Ops 4's pick a bribe. They bought the VMP, they sweated it, got Dark Matter, and that's it. They played with the VMP Dark Matter for the rest of their time. That's like the story for every player who's played Black Ops 4, and I feel like that's gonna be me in like a year. I'll just be on Black Ops 4 sweating in my free time when I've finished a dark, like a grind in Modern Warfare. I'm just like, okay, I'm going to play Black Ops 4 Dark Matter VMP. Oh, wow, I can select more attachments. I should be doing the challenges. Why have I not thought of this? Why have I not been doing my challenges? I'm such a buffoon. 
Okay. Uh, high caliber. Gotta take the ghost perk off. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, no, it's, it's five attachments and a scope, isn't it? Yeah. Not taking five attachments. Okay, there goes the third one. And then I have to put the fifth one on, which is going to require me taking that off. So pretty much the entire class is just dedicated to this one weapon. I'm going to have to do that one last because I don't want to do it right now. Doing it without any attachments equipped. I can probably do it once I hit like max level and I prestige it. I'll have to use no attachments, so I'll just do it then. Looks like we've got it all planned out for now. Pretty epic. Yeah, this is so. This is such a good time just to take advantage of Black Ops 4 with camo grinding. I know no one's going to be on it right now. Uh, like anyone who's going to just randomly start doing it now from my YouTube or my Discord circle. And I know for a fact that by the time you probably get onto the game, it might just get rid of the XPs or something. So it's not going to last forever. But, you know, I wish it did. It would have been useful if it did last forever because it would be easier for the grind overall. It probably might make the game probably more popular. Two more players, please. What the fuck? Did you have to burp? Stop burping! Guys, can you hear that? There's a guy just belching down the fucking mic on the other team. And it's making me feel sick. Livinium Demon. This guy has no manners. No manners at all. He probably fucking sticks his ass all in the camera as well when he's making videos. If he had a channel, he would stick his ass in the camera. Or he would just burp in the fucking mic. He muttered some, like, incoherent English. I couldn't even tell what the fuck he said. Mic's too quiet. We need one more player. Who is going to subject themselves to some sweaty torture on, t on Nuketown? Anyone? The game started or did it crash? What happened? It definitely crashed. Yeah, that, that I was going to say, I didn't hear that the match was going to start. There was like one person we were still waiting for. I don't know what happened. Why the lobby randomly decided to crash is beyond me, but... I've been disconnected. What do you mean I've been disconnected? Where the fuck is my internet? Huh? What? The fuck does that even mean? There was literally nothing wrong with it and it randomly just said internet's off. And somehow the stream's still connected, so that definitely is bullshit. Okay, it's making a weird noise. Game crashed. I have no actual clue what the hell happened there. That is uh, weird, to say the least. The stream is actually still connected, so I know it's definite bullshit. It's the game just bugging my Xbox out. Wow. Well, I mean, you can see everything. You can see everything that's going on right now. What a way to go, um, Xbox. That was pretty cring. So I've got to boot the whole game up again. I feel like maybe someone was just being an asshole and just like, you know, listening to me next door and they just like, shut the fuck up, Will. Just switch the internet off. <sighs> that was very random. I've not been having any lag and then randomly, out of the blue, you know, just disconnects. The game randomly takes me out. Pretty goofy. Let's try that again, shall we? I wonder how many other people have that issue. Because sometimes I've um, had that internet issue where it randomly takes me out of a lobby. 
And so I go back to find a new lobby and then all the people who were in the previous one start to load into the next one. Like, not like they're already there, but they all start joining in. So it's almost under the, I'm almost under the impression that Black Ops 4 just has really weak servers that just collapse at random points and people just have to join back in. That could be what just happened. I don't know. But that was weird. But alas, the stream hasn't ended and nothing's happened. I just boot the game back up. I don't know if I want to save these up. I can't. I don't know if I can really be bothered saving up 50 crates just to get a pick a bribe. Considering I'm not even probably going to use the VMP even if I did select it. I'm not even going to pick it. Um, I'm not going to use it until I've finished my other guns anyway. So it seems kind of random. Hell, let's do some unboxings unless it's going to join me into a match. No, I'm on my own. Okay. Well, I guess that makes me the host. So if I leave at any point, it's going to have to migrate the host. <laughs> yeah, noobs. Give me noobs. Give me noobs. How is he recruit one? That's like he's never played a match before. Right. Okay. So he's, he's recruit one. But he has this titanic voyage of the damned i think voyage of the whatever is the zombies map for black ops 4 that's on the titanic i don't know if that's maybe an automatic unlock but i don't know let's do some unboxing oh my god i'm becoming a review channel uh, i've got this i've already got the arabesque camo for another weapon i think for the swordfish actually the one i'm using right as we speak can we get us something good uh, no i don't drink so i don't like drinking emblems that in that entail alcohol it's not cool that is literally the lamest recon skin i've ever seen how is that epic rarity there's literally nothing on that is it what is it a different texture like what was the use of that oh that's just a bruno face paint for zombies slimed for the gks that's a pretty decent um uh, camo nothing crazy though uh, another arabesque camo, this time for the ICL-7. Well, I don't need it because I've got diamond on that, so. Oh, another one. Afterlife MX-9 reactive camo. That looks really cool. I want to have a look at what that looks like because I do actually have... Why is his mic popping up? Like, every time I speak. No, it's still moving. Okay. I thought that was pretty weird. Um... I want to have a look at what that camera looks like, because even though I already have diamond on the MX-9, I, I want to take a look at what this camo is. Afterlife. Oh, it's just this. I already have this. It's cool. It's kind of a bit like Dark Matter, I guess, but like, it's nothing crazy. I already have it. Why is this guy eating his mic? Snake Green YT, and his emblem says YT. Yeah, we get it. We get you're a YouTuber. You don't need YouTube in your in your clan tag and in your name we can see that let's have a look let's see if this is another one of those youtubers with youtube names and you look them up and they have no subs or they have 30 subs or they don't even appear Let, let's see i generally want to see if this pops up snake green it's the most basic name as well, Snake Green. Like, how, what's... Yeah, literally, no channels show up. It just shows up with snake videos. I'm going to have to go to channels. There is someone who does .exe videos in a bunch of random games, mostly Minecraft. And he has... He has 1.56k. Well, if, even if this was him, I have more than him. So, haha. <laughs> um... I, d I don't think this guy plays Black Ops 4 somehow. And if he does, he probably plays it on the side for a bit of fun. Um, there's some guy with one sub who does random biking videos. Appears to be Russian, so that's definitely not them. This guy with GTA videos hasn't uploaded in five years. Yeah, no, I don't see any Snake Green videos. So maybe you've got an, a, a very weak name that's like camouflaging with every other name in the damn search results or your channel's irrelevant but uh you don't exist on youtube when i search you up so that's that's all that can that that's all that concerns me if you don't show up then you're probably just irrelevant oh markiplier upload another video five nights at juniors part two i can't wait to watch that that's gonna be cool 
I already watched his first one, I think. It's over an hour. It was very good. Oh, okay. Match is going. Let's go. Uh, recon. Sure. God, I feel so cold. What the fuck? What happened? Are you taking the piss? Again, game randomly fucking crashed. What's what's the excuse now that my internet's fine and the next minute it's gonna say it's off again? This shit is a fucking joke. Yeah, I've been disconnected my ass. It's probably a connection issue with like I don't know if it's my don't know if it's my something to do with my thing bugging out my Xbox. Sometimes having my external hard drive plugged in actually causes weird bugs, which is super weird. But it does it does that sometimes. So I'm under the impression it could be my thing bugging out. But it, it shouldn't be because it's been working all day. It's it's just Black Ops 4's been retarded now. I feel like there might be someone in the game just DDoSing people, or just like temporarily kicking them from the servers. I don't know why you would be doing that, but... Let's have a look at what this skin is. Wow. This is, see, this this makes sense to be uh, epic rarity. It's actually a fully different costume. It's like a frogman suit. This, there's nothing to this that makes this any different to like the basic operator skin. Like, what? what's even the point of this? That is the lamest skin I've ever seen. How is that epic rarity? That should be, like, grey rarity. It's, no one wants to wear that. Oh, I've joined the uh, one I was in earlier. The same people are in here. Let's go. Let's go. Hell yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. Look, another racist. What's with these people with the racist emblems in this fucking game? I swear to God. Did I just back out? Please don't tell me I backed out. I think I clicked B as it was starting. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Shit. Well, yep, this game is full of racists, as usual. That's no surprise. I've seen, like, dozens of them, though. It's kind of scary. Uh, I feel like they're probably going to, like, hang me or something. These evil people. Ugh. Anyway. Wow, these people apparently have already selected, so I guess I've joined late. They've all got dark matter, apart from this guy here, like, and the other guy on the end. Two of these have dark matter. Oh no, the game actually started. Okay, it wasn't mid-start. There's another one, Snowy, on YouTube. Why is there so many YouTubers playing in this fucking game? Is everyone just hopping on the bandwagon because of me? Because I swear, like, Jev made a Black Ops 4 video, but it was like a month or two ago. I'm the only one who's been really posting, like, Black Ops, Black Ops 4 recently. I feel like maybe these people are just sort of, like, noticing the videos and they're like, Oh my god, I should probably play this game. So it's just very weird. I'm just seeing a lot of YouTubers playing this shit now. When I say shit, I'm, I'm just saying it as a replacement for stuff. Or this thing. I don't think this game's shit, by the way. It has it, it has its issues, but it, it's, uh, it's a beautiful work of art. If I say so myself. A lot of people will disagree with what I have to say about Black Ops 4. But I, um, I don't care. Because this game will go down as one of my favourites. I think it's one of the best in COD 1.0. We're now getting COD 2.0 with the whole Modern Warfare 2. But again, Modern Warfare 2, I don't know how it's going to go. I haven't had the beta access yet, so I'm really bummed about that. But, um... So far for what I'm seeing, I've seen, my two issues just visually of what I've seen in videos is the kill sound effect is not satisfying compared to Modern Warfare 2019. It doesn't have, like, the crack sound to it. Like, when you kill someone, it goes, like, pfft, like a proper, like, I don't know. It feels like you actually are killing players instead of just, like, some lame shit. What is going on with people leaving? Stop migrating hosts and leaving fucking matches. It just bugs everything out. These idiots. I swear one of them probably just joined and had like one camo to do and he finished it or something and then just left. 
Like, other than that, there's no reason to leave unless you're just downright terrible at the game and you're getting bummed on. And I don't think any of us are really that sweaty, so he's probably just bad, whoever that was that left. Uh, so, what was I saying? Yeah, so, visually off what I've seen, Modern Warfare 2 isn't actually terrible. It's just I have little, um, what do you call them? I have little, just... I've forgotten the the um the phrase for it. My like nitpicks, I guess. See, this is what I mean. Look, it's like ninety percent of the time, if someone like leaves the game, it will never successfully like uh, rehost a new player. It will literally just crash the lobby and say that the connection was lost when it wasn't. The person just left. That is so dumb. Why are there even, like, hosts for the lobbies in these games anyway? Like, I don't get that. It makes no sense. It, it, all, it actually really doesn't make any sense. We're playing in a multiplayer game. There shouldn't be any hosts other than the actual server itself that hosts itself. Th and then there literally shouldn't be, like, players having to host the shit. Like, you know, just because they were the first in a lobby. <laughs> I just looked at my bots. Alien conglomeration. What a name. We've got loads of like tiny aliens compacted into a profile. That looks really nice. Um, all right, so as I was saying, uh, Modern Warfare 2. My only issues are with the sound effects. The kill, the kill sound effect doesn't sound as satisfying. Now they can always change that. That is literally like a tiny tweak they can do uh, post beta before the actual release. They can easily switch that out. And if they don't switch it out and they just keep it the same, they can always make an option in the settings. They did this with Modern Warfare 2019 where in Modern Warfare 2019 we had a option in the settings to revert back to the classic MW hit marker sound effect. So they could easily just do it with this game. They should. They could make either modern, uh, original OG MW sound effects as well as Modern Warfare 2019 sound effects for anyone who likes the pre prefers the classic sound effect. Because uh, I would happily use like the classic Modern Warfare 20, not classic Modern Warfare, but the Modern Warfare 2019, you know, the prequel uh, game. Um, you know, just I'd rather use that game's um, kill effect because it sounds more juicy. It sounds more satisfying. So I'd probably rather use that. But the only other issue I have with MW2 this year is the gameplay doesn't look as realistic as Modern Warfare 2019. Like, it looks very glossed over for some weird reason. It looks almost like Cold War meets Modern Warfare in a weird way. Like, this is what people were saying with Vanguard, though. People were saying Vanguard is like Cold War, Modern Warfare. Actually, no, they weren't. They were saying it was Cod World War 2 mixed with modern warfare which is basically what it is but like this year it's like modern warfare with cold war like they can never make a standalone game that actually feels different it always has to have a hint of the other game in there which it kind of disappoints me i feel like modern warfare 2019 was such a standout from the previous card competitors that it felt so unique and different to the point that you couldn't even compare it to other cards it just didn't feel the same like, people could have probably said, like, oh, it looks like ghosts or something, like, but upgraded, like, uh, but no one said that. I don't think anyone said that about Modern Warfare 2018. It just has its own feeling to it. It looks really realistic and almost so, when I say gritty, I don't mean it has to be, like, really violent and dirty and dim, but, like, th there is a grittiness to it. Like, the realism looks very realistic. In this Modern Warfare 2, it looks realistic, but some of it looks extremely colourful and glossed over, like Cold War, which is literally, I don't know, I don't know if that will grow on me or not, or if it'll just sort of, I'll forget about Modern Warfare 2018 and just not realise it, but it, it doesn't look too promising considering it's kind of a bit more animated rather than realistic, but hell, it might surprise me, I might grow on on it a little bit. I might just sort of ignore what the old Modern Warfare 2018 used to look like and just think, who cares? What is with people in these emblems? Look! This is fucking filth! Ugh. He had to go out of his way to make the shade, like, look a lot like actual fucking poo. His emblem says lick poo and it has ha ha. Like, what's wrong with people in this game? Are these people like, like six-year-olds or something? Are they just like ingrates? 
They, they just sit in Black Ops 4 and make weird emblems. Huh. One more player, come on. No, stop leaving. Stop leaving! Trying to stay in the lobby. I'm not gonna tell you again. Just just stay and don't leave. Ugh, one more. Ugh, ugh. want to grind this gun and I'm having to wait for these weirdos to join. Oh, most of them at level 50. Oh my god. Maybe they just never prestiged and they just stayed at level 55 on the first level 55 like they never prestiged, but like I doubt it. I feel like they probably had just reached 55 and they're not prestiging now because they've been playing for about a week and they're trying to grind weapons. I don't think anyone would long-term stay level 55. They'd probably prestige. It just kind of makes sense to do that. But I don't know, some people just avoid prestiging for some reason. Okay. Uh, recon. Can I have a game this time that doesn't disband or doesn't disconnect? Can I have, can I have a host that doesn't leave? The game of uh, surprises. Hmm. Two. Just like that. Th that two camos without dying th or two rapid kills is going to get completed like extremely quick. Have I gotten four now? Or is that three? I haven't really been paying attention. Oh, shit. Kind of jump scared me a little bit. Not not really, but you know, kind of. Huh. Well, uh, oh no, that's a teammate. I am sorry. I, I I'm a dick. Um, I just hope he doesn't kill me mal uh, kill me back in return. Oh, two. Ah, penthouse camo complete. That's honestly not even a challenge. Two kills like dying rapidly is like so fucking easy. It's almost a joke. Like actually putting that as a camo is a honestly a joke. Like anyone can hop into a small map like Nuketown. Considering they literally made a lobby for Nuketown only. Making that a camo challenge seems kind of weird. Like why would you make a camo challenge when you know you've made a lobby that literally makes it easy for people? Seems a bit weird, but... I'm not complaining. I, I mean, I am kind of complaining, but it's it's kind of in more of a uh, an entertaining way. I'm not really too mad. I'm not actually mad. I, I actually like the challenges are easy. I want to get the gold easy. I want to get dark matter easy. But I don't want it to be too easy. Because if, if it was really easy to do camo grinds, you would see that it's not hard for people to get the camos. And it would make the mastery grind not feel like it's actually a mastery. So, you know, I, I want it to feel kind of challenging, but like not excruciatingly sweaty where you're literally dripping sweat to finish something where are these people killing me from i literally look in these buildings and no one's ever there i divert my my focus for like two seconds and i'm fucking annihilated out of nowhere when look oh it's a teammate okay maybe it was a teammate who killed me before i mean i doubt it but it could have been that would be kind of sussy hmm what the actual hell are you doing now? Who sits at the front of the buildings in Nuketown? You're literally in the open. Does he not use his brain? You got lucky that time. If I catch you again, like, you know, fucking hell. That, that would be in a video where you would insert that. Ooh, don't pull out the ninja mole. I would fucking destroy you. Like, ooh, oh, oh, sorry, Jamal. Don't pull out the nine. <laughs> Whoa. See, I knew my, I know my memes too well now. Oh. Okay. What? 
Why is the internet taking a fucking dookie again? What's going on? This is lame. I'm going to sit here, actually, and wait for them to spawn so I can spawn trap them. Easy, easy clutch. Bring it on, boys. Mm. Ah, that's a nice inspect. You get the whole gun in the, uh, in the screen. I like that. With a lot of these newer games, when you inspect a weapon, it's not even in the fucking frame. Like, it, it just, it's literally like a, a sniper that goes off the screen, so you can't even make a good thumbnail on it. Maybe unless that's just with Modern Warfare 2018, that would make sense, because Modern Warfare 2018, because he doesn't have, like, higher than 80 field of view on console, it makes taking screenshots for thumbnails uh, even worse, as it is, because it's already bad, like, trying to play the game on 80 field of view. I think this game's on 80 field of view as well, and it actually doesn't even feel bad. It feels good. So that's that's pretty funny. Considering everyone bashes COD for having 80 field of view, and it ha looking awful, this game somehow manages to pull it off, and it doesn't even feel that bad. I can't even see where you are, mate. I can't even see his head. He's literally, like, skimming the fucking ceiling in there. Oh, he broke it. He's triggered. He's triggered. He doesn't want me finding them, does he? Because he knows they're all fucking camping up there. What the hell? It didn't even say I was killed. What the fuck is wrong with this internet? Why am I flying back and forth? I'm not on Noah's Ark. I'm not in the fucking deadly ocean. Stop doing this shit. Oh my god. Come on. What's my teammate shooting me? Have you got like extra chromies or something? This, this fucking game. I can't even spawn. Like, it was just literally not doing anything. What is going on? What is going on? Can you stop, like, bouncing me back and forth? If I wanted to go on a bouncy castle, I would just arrange one. But, you know, I am 18, so I don't really go on bouncy castles anymore. But, you know, I, I didn't ask, so please stop making bouncy castles for me in my games. I'd greatly appreciate it. Where the fuck are they hiding at? What, what's... It's like every time I go to look for them, it just wants to lag. And when I'm on the on the side where they're not appearing, the lag doesn't it doesn't happen. This is this some sort of like highly escalated tactic to take me out? What is this? Teammate? What? The hell? Why is everyone all over the place? What is going on? I can't even shoot people! The game is lagging horrendously. I don't even want to move, because every time I move, it's just going to do that horrible jitter where it's going to bounce me back and forth. You know I'm cracked at the game, and you don't want me to win. That's all this is. It's just a plot to take me out. <laughs> Alright, okay. <laughs> what a great final kill. He just dived into me. Is he on our team? No, he's on the other team. He's an op. Screw the ops. Wait, what's his... 24 to 30... Okay, 24 to 34. I was going to say, if he had, like... I thought it said 300, and I was like, what? Because then there would be a definite hacker on the game if it said 300 fucking kills or something. Uh, I'm going to have to put, a, like, a dressing gown on or something. I'm freezing. I. It's weird. I'm cold, even though I've felt completely normal all day. It's like at night time, it's just dropping now, the temperatures. It's kind of creepy. Maybe the Grim Reaper's coming for me, guys. Rest rest in peace. I'm, I'm dead. I'm screwed. That cannot be a bot. That's... Wait, that's not a bot. I've got someone watching me who's uh doesn't even speak my language and doesn't even play this game. Well, wow. okay. Well, that's cool. Um... Wow, we've actually got, like, 12 people here. This is crazy. This game isn't dead. I knew it wasn't dead. It's just the lobbies are weird now. I was going to say, if this game was dead, I'd be very surprised because it's very good. I'm going to take this ugly camo off now, and I'm going to put on the penthouse camo. I, just, I think it's just better that I do that, just because it just doesn't look that aesthetically pleasing. Look at Dark Matter. I just won it already. Oh, it's so beautiful. It might look a bit weird on here, but 
It's a nice camo. It's a very nice camo. Someone was speaking in the game, and if they were talking to an IRL, if they're just talking to a mate or they were talking to me, I don't know. Like, how are you doing or something? Didn't hear it. Don't really care. Um, why win to loss ratio is 2.25. That's actually good. Our average EKIA EKI is 18 point something. That is insane. What the fuck? No way. It's kind of wild. Or should I say, that's kind of wild. What the hell? This shit is absolutely fucking crazy. Look at this. It's basically like cheat code gold. It's just like a rip-off wish version of gold. Uh, stop using LMGs, puppy. Uh. That was a bit sus. I'm gonna not lie there. That was a bit sus. What is going on? Stop! Demon's Rage, you're definitely not 21. If, if you have 21 in your name because you think you're 21, you, you're not. Anyone with Demon's Rage as a name is like six. <laughs> He's sweating with a cordite. It's always the people with the cordites who sweat in this fucking game. It's, all, it's either cordites or it's VMPs. What is going on? Why is this game so fucking laggy? I actually want to die. This is terrible. I, I don't know if it's if it's having 12 players is supposed to cause lag or something. But this hasn't been happening much all day at all. Now all of a sudden I'm getting connection interrupted. Fucking flying back and forth. Clipping through the damn map. This, this is just absurd. This is absolutely absurd. Uncanny ridiculous amounts of fucking lag. Yeah, someone's probably of a team fucking like DDoSing. Imagine, imagine if that was actually happening. That would be pretty wacky. But no, my teammates are perfectly getting kills, so it appears to just be my shitty Xbox as always. I got three kills there. What the fuck? I didn't even, I didn't even see three people in a collateral. That makes no sense. And this, this, this absolute ingrate on the other team, Mark T G E. Just, you know, got he's got his damn sniper's nested now, so now I'm gonna get fucking picked off like a like a duck in the sky during fucking shooting season. Hello, <laughs> puppy, I got you. <laughs> Stop. Stop liking every time I get a streak, it's kinda cringe. See, it did it again. It jittered and then the guy had killed me. I didn't even actually see him fire his weapon. Th this is terrible. I, there, there could legitimately be fucking noobs on the other team that are just so bad they need to lag the game out. But I, I, I don't know much about DDoSing. I do know that you're overriding a server with, like, multiple bot profiles. So it basically crashes the network. But maybe there's certain limited numbers of it you can do. Like, mild DDoSing that can, like, lag games out for other people. Because I'm pretty sure people have done that before. Um... I, I've seen it happen with like, I don't know if I've seen it with streamers or someone has played a game before and the game kept lagging and crashing because the other team was doing it, but like it's happening again. It, it's, it's literally the moment I'm about to get my fifth kill, just fucking straight up lags. Look, it, it's so, it's so obnoxious. I hope my teammates aren't experience, experiencing this. I would not wish this on my worst enemy. This is the worst kind of lag ever. I feel like I'm on like 800 ping. But, like, it's kind of varying up and down. Because normally when it's constantly on an 800 ping, I'm just no non-stop lagging. But here it's not as bad as it's been on some streams where it just non-stop crashes. But here it's pretty bad. It's not much better. It's, it's kind of making me suffer. Like, you can see I'm shredding these people. Because we're in hardcore and I'm using a really good gun. And I'm actually good. So, you know, no cap. It's just, I feel like the lag is a whole fucking fancy... Yeah, literally! I nearly had five kills again! Again! That is like, I can't account how many times that's fucking happened now. 
fifth kill and it's just about to get it. Lag. Just we'll cut that out for you. You're not getting that kill, bitch. That's basically what it's saying to me. Again, again. Are you are you joke? Is this a is this a fucking joke? It's lagging again. Oh my fucking god. You know what? I'm not even going to jinx it. Just not going to say anything. If it lags, it lags. If I get my kills, I'm not going to rub it in. I'm just going to let it happen. See what happens. Oh, the game ends. Good stuff. Ugh, of course this retard gets the replay. Of course. He's just he's just sweating on everyone. With with one of the like tiniest guns in the game. What an idiot. Look look at this guy. He's absolutely sweating. I anyone who plays like that deserves to be exiled to North Korea. I don't care. It's just sad. Watch him come in and sweat on me again. And that cut my streak off. There he is again. What did I say? He fucking bounced in with his little tiny sog 9mm and just... He probably busts it down on fucking TikTok. Oh my god! Barn is taking a dookie right now. This internet is a joke. This is actually a joke. This No, it's TP Link's a joke. TP Link's taking a dookie. What the actual fuck? This is inhumane amounts of fucking lag. Like, what is this shit? Do I have time for this shit? No, I, I want to finish this damn stream ASAP. I want to get my diamond tactical rifles and just chill. I don't want to sit here and, and face up to like two hours straight of solid lag and, you know, de decelerate my fucking progression for the camos. Like, this is just... I haven't got time to be sat around making fucking five hour streams. All it's gonna do is actually just make it so that like exporting like, this is ridiculous and then no one would want to watch it back either. I get why are they behind me? Why are they behind me? You're literally supposed to be in front of us. This game makes no fucking sense. The teammates are spawning in front of us, so we go forward. Bam, they're fucking behind us. Like what what even is this logic? Ugh. Hmm. My teammate's holding them back, which is preventing me getting kills. So maybe I should just sit down here and spawn trap. Sounds like a plan. Uh, as long as these guys don't keep spawning here. We should get a good uh, ball moving here, but I, I doubt it because these guys keep spawning over here. Again, yeah, it's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. Mm -hmm. Oh. Of course, it's Mark Tidge with his uh, Sorg again. Am I going to have to seriously leave the lobbies that he's in? Because I feel like he's causing the lag. He's sweating so fucking much. And he's making this unbearable. I would rather have lag and have newbie enemies against me than have lag and sweats against me. It doesn't make the chances of it any easier. At least with lag against noobs, the noobs are guaranteed to be garbage anyway. So you can still get your fucking kills. VMP. Why am I not surprised? I'm- what? Is that my teammate? What's wrong with you guys? Definitely some extra chromies in there. Holy fuck. What is going on? 
I think we need Harambe back. Harambe was the reason this shit wasn't happening. Harambe was the savior of our fucking internet. He was the savior of the earth. Everything went wrong since Harambe died. Oh, fuck. I want to die. System override. Your lag is going to fucking skyrocket because we feel like it. Have you ever tried bouncy castles? Well, sure, you can get them here in Black Ops 4 for free. I didn't even shoot my teammate. That's the fucking lag for you. I didn't even shoot him. Doesn't make any sense. What? Why? You won't even reload my damn gun. I did. I honestly didn't try to shoot you. It, it, I thought my teammates are going to think I'm such a dick just shooting at them. I'm literally not even trying to. My game is fucking like having a hemorrhage. This game's like spasm. Oh shit, no, I'm gonna get cancelled like Lizzo. You can't say spazzing, it's ableist. Stop! Please, please stop fucking lagging. Oh, I'm- I have given up. I'm leaving. I am leaving, I've had a fucking enough of this lobby. No way is this copable, this is terrible. Terrible levels of lag that. I, I feel like it's that arsehole in there that's causing the lag. Chat's dead. Let me put some uh, goblins in here. Where's the goblin emote? Il Illuminati's. There we go. This chat's Illuminati confirmed. And I need some go. Oh good, oh good, oh good. There we go. Ogres are epic, so we'll put ogres in chat. Well, I mean, we're doing progress actually. We've nearly finished this, so I guess it's not all for nothing. Find me a lobby that doesn't lag, please. Please, if that's actually in your possibilities, Black Ops 4. Sure as shit ain't anything else that's doing it, so I'm pretty sure it's the lag. Fail to host a lobby. I don't want to host a lobby. I want to find a lobby. <laughs> Bot's going crazy. The only viewers I can actually hold in my stream are all just bots. Okay, please tell me he's not in here. He's not. Oh, let's go. Oh, we've got a... Jesus Christ, with a Nazi emblem, of course. Of course. That's about average, about par for this game. D faking. No, Deacon. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Did he make that? Pretty impressive, bro, but you probably have no fucking following or anything, so I don't know why you'd make something like that that looks like a... That looks kind of like like an emblem you'd make if you were making graphics for a content creator. Don't make a single spot for that Mark person to join back in, or whatever it was called. Or whatever, uh, you know, the guy was in the previous game sweating. Don't make a space for him. I, I don't want to see him join my lobby ever again. He's an absolute loser, and he, he just drips his dick off over to this game, so... That one game actually screwed my KIA to death ratio up. I'm concerned. That I'm actually pretty... Com I'm pretty sure I can say it has. Like, I don't care about it, but, you know, I can say that it that goes to show. It's taken a hit on, me, on my thing. It's gone down to 0 0.89. Thanks to the sweats. Oh, great. The game crashed. Again. Fuck me. This shit is so useless. This fucking game, my guy. Like, what? What? Oh, God. 
Oh, your internet is not on. Yes, it fucking is. <sighs> I'm too tired of this shit. Just stop lagging. I don't get it. It's it's been fine all day. It's li it's literally not even able to go online now. Like what what does that even mean, bro? I'm literally online. The internet works. It's this game being fucking stupid again. This is so dumb. This is actually dumb. Like, the amount of times this shit has crashed now. Quit, boot it back up. We go again for the third time, I'm pretty sure now. Second time, I don't know. Yeah. Wonder if it's gonna fix itself or if it's just gonna keep going at it. It's like the game has a mind of its own. It, it just it just it takes pleasure in watching me suffer from lag. That that is complete bullshit. I am literally connected. Unless you're going to now say I'm not connected yet. Yeah, there we go. That's the excuse. If the excuse doesn't work, they've got to actually disconnect my internet. Fucking nonsense, bro. This shit is so fucking crap, bro. Let's see what it says. Let's see what it actually gives me. Let's see if it's going to tell me your internet is fucking terrible and it's failed. <laughs> Technical difficulties, guys. We'll be right back. <laughs> Except I'm not live on air and I don't have a t technical difficulty system, so... Yeah, it says it's open. So what's the excuse Black Ops for? You just want to disconnect my internet yourself? Is that what it is? Is that what this joke is? Oh, come on. Why can't it... There we, what the fuck? Why is this all locked? Hardcore new time I'll just try again. I, d I have no clue what's wrong with this damn game. It just chooses to do it at the worst times. Never never when I'm actually trying to fucking play the, da the damn game. Like, in, in normal time. It's always just let's cause issues the moment that he's streaming. It's, it's, it's almost completely... Um, as you'd say, it's kind of coordinated on purpose. Like a, like a downtime. As soon as you stream, as soon as you hit stream, just crash everything. Yeah, I didn't think it would have found me a lobby. That was uh, clear BS. Um... I bet all the lobbies are have already are already ongoing, and it's just not going to be able to add me in.
How many do I need to do again? Ah, I've forgotten. Um, oh, eight. Eight more. Okay. And then I can just knock all the attachments off and not deal with attachments. This shit is so easy. The game knows that this challenge is too easy. And they're trying to make it harder on me by lagging. It's, it's, like, a, it's like a sick mind game. How can we fuck his game up the best as possible? Pretty sure the game audio is gone. Yeah, because I've turned it I turned it up to maximum and then nothing happened, so... Uh, deactivate, activate. That should make a difference. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it just does that anyway. Yikes. Find me a lobby, please, Black Ops 4. Hmm. Seems to be searching for quite a bit, doesn't it? Looks like I could be here for 5-10 minutes, waiting for a game to end. Like, at this point, just add me into an ongoing match. I'd take that over anything. That's better than nothing. No, it's not joining me. It's just disconnecting me again. Lobby is unjoinable or it's full. <sighs> just make dedicated servers again and this wouldn't be an issue. I, I don't get it. It's going to do it again. Oh, no, it hasn't. It's found me the lobby. Okay, cool. Oh, no. Mark TGE's in here. Oh, fuck no. He's an absolute bum sweat. I, I, I doubt this guy. This guy is less likely to stop using... Actually, no, you know what? He is more likely to stop... To, to actually somersault... Off of a fucking building. Then swap that weapon out. I'm telling you. He's just not going to do it. He, he, <laughs> these noobs use the same guns every game. And they think they're sweaty because they're using a lightweight gun. He's sweating. But sweating doesn't make you good by the way. If someone calls you a sweat or a tryhard. It doesn't mean you're actually very good. Sometimes it just means you're actually trying really hard. You hence, you're breaking a sweat to actually play the game. Hmm. Oh, he's mad. Yeah, he got a bit salty there. Killed him and he went, wow. He sounded like XQC. Wow. Ch -ch -ch. So that's clapping. Ear rape, XQC. Who team killed him? Who team killed him? Guys, we need to find out who team killed this poor, this poor man. No. Who is it even that's speaking? I should be able to see his mic. Oh, it's living in Diem. Okay. Well, I'm not team killing people, and if I do, it's an accident. Usually it is an accident, unless they blatantly point the gun at you. See what I said about this Mark TG guy? TGE? He's still using... He's still using the Sorg. 
I literally said as well, the chance of him swapping this out are less likely than someone backflip than him doing a backflip off a building. Like it's actually embarrassing. I actually get alive. I can't believe that this is the state of BO4. People sweating with the fucking sweatiest pistols and S not even pistols, it's SMGs every damn time. I'm yet to see someone using a damn pistol. Your parents don't love you, Kyle. Oh, yeah, it's Kyle. He's fucking sat there. What an idiot. Oh, I killed the teammate, but it wasn't him. Okay, I don't want to wind up Mr. Whatever he's called. Because that would be not a... That would be a no-go zone if I did that. Oh. Level 15. Okay. We've maxed it out. So, I guess if we finish the challenge, which we're about to finish in two kills time. And I, uh, I'll have to take all the attachments off after prestiging it. Because they'll get removed automatically. I guess that's perfect timing in that regard. But, I, I mean, I don't really want to. Because I want to finish the Bloodthirsties first. If I can. Or at least something like that. But I doubt I will be able to. Considering I keep getting fucking killed. Yeah, I, I might have to sit around a bit because this Marktage guy is just not, he's not going away. He's just, he's sweating on everyone here. He probably has nothing better to do, actually. I mean, I have nothing better to do. I, I literally am unemployed and yet I still wouldn't fucking sweat on a game as hard as he is. He's probably dripping his fucking dick to this game. What a loser. I have to keep watching my back as well, because he could literally just run up on me at any minute. That's how he plays. He literally just runs around, sweating on everyone, bunny hopping. I mean, I don't. I'm not against people running around. That's how you're supposed to play the damn game. But when people need to get a kill streak going for a challenge, it does piss me off when people start sweating on you. What is wrong with you? You literally looked at me and then you fired your gun. What is wrong with you? Brain dead fucking teammates. Are you just fucking idiots? See, I did it back to you. How do you feel? See, I looked at you and shot you back. Just like he looked at me and then fired his gun. What an idiot. Watch it become like a, a toxic cycle of just like shooting each other. That's usually what most team killing ends up being. Unless he's like fair player and he just thinks, oh, I deserve it. <laughs> I don't get it. Some people just don't use their eyes. Or they react and they pull the trigger and then obviously the bullets don't fire until they've actually... Like, they press the, the trigger but nothing happens and then it just fires randomly. I must say, some of the killing is out of sync with the guns a little bit. Sometimes, like, it can bug out. Oh, it's doing the lag again. Hmm. Are they... Are they, are they has he picked my gun up by any chance? Because he's using the swordfish, and I swear I haven't seen anyone using the swordfish this entire time. He could quite well be using my gun, to be fair, because it is pretty powerful in this mode. What a loser. What a loser. <clears throat> th th this is the perfect example of someone needs to touch grass, is Marktage right here. Just touch grass. It doesn't hurt. I know it's a bit prickly on the feet, but you know, it it doesn't hurt to touch grass. It is free, after all. I mean, hey, I, I've touched grass, and I'm always on uh, making that YouTube grind, you know, so I mean, there's no excuses. Wow, pleasure. I, I had to watch a guy camp. What a way to go. Okay, if it doesn't lag, I should be good. We've definitely already finished the purple hex camo, because I saw it pop up before, so... Maybe I need to do what he's doing, just camp. Because apparently that's the way to go with this fucking game, if you just camp. I literally stood behind the metal bar, but like, okay, let's just pretend I didn't. 
kind of backwards logic is this shit? I'm l literally take cover and they still shoot you through the cover. It's metal, for fuck's sake. You can't shoot through metal last time I checked. Especially if it's not malleable. And that's clearly like some ricocheting type of metal material right there. That just doesn't make any sense. It skims the blocks. I don't know where my team's at right now because I'm constantly getting killed. So it's almost like my teams are doing no help here at all. I think they've called in a sniper's nest. Oh, they're all in here. This is why it's no use for me. They're all camping. Well, I'm going to join you boys because it looks like we have no chance against the sweats. Camping's the way to go. In this scenario, of course. Oh, okay. They're coming through. They're coming through. Come on out, wussies. Please. Please. Pretty please. I'm saying pretty please. That's got to mean something. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I see feet. I see feet. Oh, oh. Sounds like the av average Redditor. I see feet. Oh, my God. My foot fetish. Bro. Oh, my God. Why is it lagging this bad? This is fucking... I didn't even shoot him. I didn't even shoot my teammate. That is fucking bullshit. This is so dumb. This game is clapped. I actually didn't fucking shoot him either. Like, the game's just crap. It's lagging. I don't even know if I'm on three kills, four kills. I've lost track completely. Wait, are they over here now? Wait, wait, is the helicopter on our team? No, he's not. It's definitely on the enemy team. Okay, fuck. I'm not... I'm not going near them. Coming out, wussies. I know you're just relying on your little score streak here to do everything for you, but... You, you need to play. You, you need to play a bit more. You need, to, you need to move. I mean, I'm saying that whilst camping, but I'm trying to do a challenge, so it's kind of justified. God, it feels good to kill him. I fucking hate him. That without gameplay would sound really wrong. Like, imagine there's no gameplay here. Uh, no, my god, what is going on? Oh, wait, I think there's someone there, is there? No. He's camping again. It's the same guy as before. EJ7U just camps in the same fucking middle section of the map. What the hell? The, the wall didn't even do anything. Then it just kills me randomly. Great logic, Black Ops 4. I am, I'm, I'm one minute, I'm fine. And then it's like, no, actually, you're poisoned from radiation. By the way. If that was the logic of real life, you step in front of electric taser and then it's like, oh, wait, you're fine. Oh, wait, no, actually, no. Newsflash, you've been electrocuted. No one would ever want to operate on electrical circuits ever again because he wouldn't know where to believe it or not. Can you give me noobs again? What happened to playing against noobs? Fucking hate these sweats. Why am I bouncing around? Stop. Again, bro. It literally nearly had five kills. And that dumbass has to slide in on me. What an idiot. That sounded so sus. <laughs> slide in on me. <laughs> no. No, don't do that out of context. Please, no. Please, no. Oh, there's too many people. Too many fucking angles to watch in this damn game. Holy shit. Go outside, you absolute ingrates. I don't give a fuck if you like this game. I like the game too. You need to touch grass. Haha, <laughs> two in a row. Did myself justice for that. That was that was deserved. 
Haha. <laughs> Free. Please give me my fifth kill. I want to leave this game and start over with no attachments and just hopefully get a different lobby with the sweats not inside of the lobby. But, you know, every time I've tried to get the lobby without the sweats, it's crashed. So, I mean, it's kind of a bit weird that... Right, they're defending the downstairs. Oh, God. Okay, that's four. I'm going to die. I'm literally going to die. I've got, like, one more kill. See? Now he, now he knows where I am. Nope. Nope. Yeah, it killed me from lag. Wow. I literally fired at the guy, but let's pretend I didn't. It's fucking game, bro. It's so, it makes no sense. No sense at all. You can fire your bullets even though they're clearly, like, not moving around in too much of the proximity they're stood in. He was- he was- I was lagging, sure, but he was only stood, like, here. So I would have killed him either way. The lag just has fucking sneaky ways to try and, like, ruin everything. Oh, what a what a an eventful game to say the least. Nothing but raging. <laughs> oh wow, I thought it'd be later than that, but it's uh it's ten thirty. So that'll probably be like five o'clock for Americans. Where's everyone at? Come on. Why's no one watching me? What's going on? Um, okay, uh, I, I mean, I really don't want to play with these assholes, to be honest with you, but it looks like I'm going to have to. I've finished that one, so let's do the one without attachments while I was working on this, so I could just prestige the weapon and then do it without attachments, it gives an excuse to, I guess, and it's higher prestige, so it's still going to be stronger, I suppose. Um, right, knock those off. Perks put back on scavenger. Definitely gonna need ghost against this against this idiot because he's just he's just being an asshole about everything. Um, gear, stim shot. I'm gonna need that definitely because I'm in hardcore. And I guess I can put the pistol back on again. Okay, well, it's the last level set of levels I need to do for this, and this is maxed out, and I'll have the cameras done, which is even better. I don't think I've finished many weapons at the point that I've maxed out the weapon. Like, I always finish the damn camos, and then I find that I've got, like, another prestige or two to go on the weapon, and I'm like, what? <laughs> that happened with the uh, with the previous gun. I think it was the Orga DMR, was it? No, it wasn't. The previous one was the ABR, and I was using that, and I just had to, like... I had to grind it for so un ridiculously long just to finish it because it was not even leveled up. But this double XP, as I say, it's doing charms. I, I would take this any day of the week. Keep this thing in here and I will be happy. But of course, it's not much of a reward to have double double on all the time. So for, I think for good reason, they, they don't allow that. But it would be good. You know, it would probably make things more enjoyable. Oh, I've got the weird scope again. Fuck. Well, it's still powerful, though. So it doesn't really matter. As long as it's powerful, I'm... I'm gonna have easy dubs here. As long as I'm not sweating. No, Mark Tidge is on my team. Let's go! I've got the sweat on my team, bitch. Take that, noobs. <laughs> it's so dumb that the biggest weapon is using the sweat to my advantage. It's so sad. When you fear the sweat, you have to make sure they're on your team. It's kind of sad. Four. See, now that the sweat's on the other team, no, it's how easy it is for me to keep a streak going without him ruining everything. Until that happened, of course. Spoke too soon. <laughs> I deserve it. What? I'm pretty sure that landed, but cool. Let's, that, wow. 
I've still got the I've got to face that same XP4 guy with the Cordite again. So there's that. Doesn't get too much better, does it? Fuck in hell. Oh my god, they're all using SMGs. One of them, I think one of them is using an LMG actually. To be fair, you know, just to be a little nice on them, you know, give some credit where it's due. But, you know, the rest of me using SMGs. What the fuck? Dude, I literally... Right. Okay. Wow. I thought the game was lagging there, but it was actually just stood still. Okay, that's weird. If they don't spawn behind them, I should be good. But I think they're going to, aren't they? It's always when I'm not focusing on behind me, they start spawning them behind me. It's like deliberate. Oh, one ran there. So I'm guessing they're now on that side. I don't know. There is the chance that they could spawn behind us still, though. So I'm not going to speak too soon. See how... What? Level 4? Bro, I literally just prestiged it before. This match. Like, I... How quick are these levels? I, I, well, does one kill equal four, like a, a full level or something now? What's going on? Fuck off. Just, just no one likes you. You literally have no friends. Someone who plays like this guy has no friends. He's such a fucking loser. Twitch. You're bullying. Get him off platform. We don't like bullies. Okay, thanks for barricading that. I can probably see this as a foreseeable camping spot now. Haha. <laughs> Try to take us out now, little sweaty twat. We're camping. Ha ha ha. Just fucking wait on him to come up. I don't even know what kills I'm on. I... Oh! Oh, he's trying to take us out from there now. Well, one of them was. See, I got a stim. That came in clutch because I didn't have stims automatically. Thanks, hardcore. Okay, that's okay. What the hell? What the fuck? What happened to my... Why did everything slow down? Like I was, like, stunned or something. That was so weird. I actually don't understand what happened there. Like, it's like I was aiming it down sight, but for some reason it just went back on its own. Slowly. I knew it. If I fucking popped in and out, he would pop show himself. There we go. Bloodthirsty. Whoop whoop. School baby. No attachments at the same time. This is coming in clutch. See, the camping spot works. It, it does. We sometimes need camping. Sometimes it's ethical camping. I'm, I told you it wasn't bullshit. Camping is sometimes very useful. But not for the sake of being an asshole, because you actually can't play the game. I can play this damn game. I Oh, I can play this game, but... You'll see that in my new video coming up in a few days. Or two days now, I should say. But it's uh, where I meet a fan. I, find, I don't meet him. I don't speak to him. But I find a fan in Black Ops 4. With my channel in my in his promotion for his emblem. And I play very well. I, I actually dob in on a bunch of sweats. I don't dob on them. Sorry, dobbing in is like telling someone off. What am I on about? My grammar and language is all over the place. But I basically absolutely annihilate the enemy team. I mean, they were pretty newbie, but I, I can easily destroy, like, pretty good level players. It's just it's just a matter of having good connection and no one using VMPs. And, you know, we're pretty much solid, but, you know, it's not always like that. Mm. I doubt he's going to go over there, considering we have traps over there, do we? I would be able to see the razor wire through the wall, theoretically, if he's, if that's not, if I can see my teammate's supply package there, I should be able to see a razor wire, so I doubt they have it there anymore. Yikes, I think they're going to be over here. Yep, they're here, they're here. He's camping with razor wires too, holy shit, it's like a battle of the razor wires, it's, it's a battle of the campers. Holy shit. Dude was over there, I saw his razor, razor wire before he shot me. <laughs> this is goofy. 
This is goofy, yeah. <laughs> Dude, he's literally called Red Ra Red Razor. Ugh, that's a tongue twister, Red Razor. And that's not a tongue twister, I'm just being dumb. But literally, he's got Razor in his name. He probably lives and breathes for Razor Wires. He probably plays talk every damn match. What the fuck? You can't wall bang in this game. I've, I've proven this before. I've proven before that you can't wall bang in this game. So how the fuck did he wall bang me? It doesn't make any sense. There's like double standards every time I play this game. Someone shoots me through the wall. I go to test the same thing on, on, on another player and it doesn't work. It, it's just, it's so weird how this game works. It's like it's got little areas where the, the bullets do work and other areas where it doesn't work. So, like, what is it? What's it going to be? That it always works or it doesn't? Or that it just works in patchy areas? Like, it just doesn't make sense. Wow. I, <laughs> trying to focus on, like, multiple people in different windows and doors is a task. I'm coming to get you, Mr. Camper. Oh, no, I can't. He's fucking blockaded it. Wow. We've got the squad going here now with all the fucking barricades. Oh wow, I can't even I can't even go up the top of the stairs. That is appalling. That is appalling level of camping that is. Holy moly. I think he's probably got UAV. Uh or well, ghost on, sorry, so. Yikes, I'm in. I'm in his camping spot. Bruh. That's got a sting. He probably thought, like, how the fuck did you get in here? If he does come up here, of course, he's going to think, how did I get in here? It's like, bro, well, there's this little thing called the window. It's not actually that little, but, you know. That's what he said. Um, Two of them in the window. Wow. Okay. They're playing our game, apparently. Camp Fest. Okay. It's two. Nope. We are spawn trapping them, but who cares? Like, it, it is kind of funny. How many kills have I got? Two, I think. Yeah, it's two. Come on, spawn in, please. Nubs. Bo Jiden would be proud of me. And I don't want to talk about Bo Jiden and Tronald Dump all day, but you know, come on. They are proud. They're, they're proud of my abysmal gameplay because they're abysmal leaders. <laughs> it's be political or anything, but I just was political. Ooh, is that four? Why is it going up so slowly? I swear I had five kills by now. I think I have ghost on. I should be hidden. Maybe. Maybe not. You know, where the hell are they? I want my fifth kill. Oh, I'm getting apprehensive. I'm getting apprehensive. Please come down here. Come down here. Please. Oh, come on. Where are they? Oh, they're going to be behind us. They're definitely going to be behind us. Oh, he was. Yep, he was behind me and he fucking killed me. Fuck you, Downey. I literally nearly had my fifth kill. Jeez. Did I get a bloodthirsty that game? I think I did. I think I might have got one. We're nearly at two hours, so we're not doing actually too bad on time, to be honest. But I hope to be finished in the next half an hour at least, or less. Look at this guy just making bloodthirsties look easy, because he's just using a sword. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Thank you.
Whoa. There's a lot of progression in that game. Holy crap. Team death match. Um, cases. Whoa. MX9. I got that camo that I have for another gun. That's pretty cool. Please don't put marketage on the other team. I mean, they're probably going to. But please don't. Three out of five. That one's half done. It's like bang on half done. Okay, that's somewhat reassuring. Okay. We've got about six, seven, eight, nine more levels to go, I'm pretty sure. And this is maxed out. So, yeah. This could be a good way to finish a gun and finish a whole weapon class in one stream. I think I'm feeling it. Look, look how many new players there are. I feel bad that they come into this game to face this kind of sweat. Like, look, level 4, level 1, level 46. Like, if you're level 46, you're definitely new. There's no lying about that. Unless you played it back in 2018 and played, like, two games. Like, you wouldn't have level 46 and not have played the game loads. Because with level 55, you'll never know because it's max level. So someone could have had max level for ages and not prestiged. But if they're level 46, that means they've never even reached the maximum yet. So they've literally just played the game for either probably... Oh, maybe a week, a few weeks, months, you know, uh, so <laughs> chances are it's probably new. There's a lot of new players here. I don't know how that's happening all of a sudden. Maybe, again, videos are sort of promoting the game more or maybe the servers have been dedicated again. Maybe they fixed the servers. That could actually be what's going on. They might have actually fixed the servers by any rare imagination, but let's just assume maybe they did. They might have fixed them, but... Oh, God. The, the Both of them are on the enemy team this time. This is even worse. Why do they always pair them together? Can you not put them on the same team? Like, if, if you're going to have a sweaty camper and a fucking sweat as it is, that's two types of sweats. It's awful. Like, how is this game going to function properly without these guys ball stomping everyone? Again, fucking XP4JJ. Every time I see his name, I want to fucking punch the guy. Absolute loser. Look, he's sitting here again. Actually, that's a different one. I, I shot at him. Okay, yeah, I, I didn't shoot at him right. Okay, wow. That makes perfect fucking sense. Actually looks like I'm going to have to camp. This is so sad. Game is actually fucking sweaty as shit. Um, they've taken talk. So can they please use talk to their advantage, please? If my teammate's going to use talk, at least actually use them properly. There we go. Fucking blood first. You made it look easy. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell? Why is all of them spawning in the same place? That was kind of wild. That was kind of wild. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. I'm about to bust. Oh my fuck, this guy stood in the open. He must be rookie. Wee. Can I get kills, please? Where is everyone? Oh god. Come on. Oh, damn it. I'm always thoroughly entertained. See, I don't need chat to be entertained. I don't even need chat to be entertained. Some streamers literally rely on chat. Like, they will literally look at the chat and they'll keep finding something to talk about. I will just ramble about the most random shit. It's probably why my ramble videos when I'm trying to discuss a serious topic ends up being, like, half an hour long. And I have to crop it down somehow because I'm just like, what the hell? Why is there so much waffle? I should start a podcast one day. I mean, I did once, but... It was a collaboratory sort of work, and it didn't end very well. <laughs> Had one episode of it, me uh, 
me and my brother and uh, Kears and Elliot. I mean, I call him I call Kears by his username because he actually never changes it. But Elliot has changed his name so many times. It used to be MVP Elliot, then it was Strive Elliot. But yeah, we had a podcast once. We did one video and it failed. It was called The Chill Zone. And it was pretty weak. It didn't even show up in the search results either because there's that many other streams, streaming podcasts called The Chill Zone. It was like the most cookie cutter name ever. So like nobody would have found it anyway unless they'd literally been given link to it or someone had literally uh, like avidly searched for it because they were like involved with the drama or something on YouTube. I actually like that there's new players in it. actually warms my heart. This game is so fucking good and I really love it. I have a I have a special thing for this game and just seeing new players coming into the game, it's it's a nice thing to see. Um you know, it's a shame that obviously with time the it's inevitable the game will die because you know, you know, new games come out, but I'm suppose there's a lot of people who will play the games regardless because they some people don't like newer games and they will just stay in the old game for the rest of their life because all they care about is fun, which should be the core of gaming, shouldn't it? it shouldn't just it shouldn't be about playing the latest game it should be about fun and i think if people have found fun in this game because i don't say i don't think the graphics are really that bad for this game they're actually really good so i suppose people are quite content with it they just think well i don't need a 2022 game when i've got the 2018 card i'll just play that one but unlike that i'm a content creator and i have to play the new game and also i kind of want to because if i didn't i would fall short of content so i, I kind of have an obligation to do so well, I, I make it an obligation, but to be honest, I kind of would need to if I need to grow as a YouTuber. Unless I was just one of those sweaty gamers who just play the game and people watch anyway. Right, that's one. Oh, someone's going around here. Two. I feel like I'm going to lose it here when I stood on this fucking corner because it's so, like... Such a dodgy spot. I literally could have killed him there, but my gun ran out. Wow. This 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 middle sector sector is the worst. It literally because it splits in two. Someone can run inside of the thing, or they can go around it, and then you never know whether they're gonna gonna pop out on the side or whatever. So by the time you've pretty much shown yourself completely to the enemy by walking out of this door. They will shoot you from inside of the middle bit. So it, it's kind of obnoxious. Got to really be careful with this game. Oh, shit. Can I gravity slam him? I want to gravity slam the guy. Haha, <laughs> you bastard. I gravity slammed the, the sweaty player. I feel good about that. You know what? That made my day. <laughs> that made my day. Just gravity slamming that noob. I call him a sweat, then I call him a noob. It's quite hypocritical, but he, he really is just bad. That's all it is. He's just fucking bad, and he's bunny hopping. Anyone can abuse a meta. Like, if sliding becomes the meta, anyone can do it, and they can just basically be completely obnoxious. I've got, like, three or four more kills to go and like, one blur bloodthirsty, so, you know, uh, I want to get it done with... <laughs> Look at them. Even Mark Tidge has resorted to using Sorgs. Oh, oh, no, he was using it the whole time, wasn't he? My bad. <laughs> this is so sad. Oh, it's switching sides. Okay, the game hasn't ended. That's good. Okay. Maybe this will be the match I finish the, the game. Finish the challenge. This entire time I've been playing with one headset piece off because I always play like that so I can actually hear how loud I'm being. Because if I can't hear how loud I'm being, I'm going to end up being ridiculously loud. And again, I, I need to make sure I can't hear other noises outside or I need to know when someone's wanting to come to my room so I can mute myself because otherwise I wouldn't hear it over the game. Like That's why I need to really hear with one ear out. <laughs> probably think, why is anyone coming to your room at like 11 o'clock? But, you know, believe me, people do. And it's not bitches. So, you know, as one would say, we all know who that one person is. If that were, if my friends were watching this, they'd know. And maybe some people in the community, but the one guy that calls 
females bitches. I mean, that's an immediate telltale sign that you don't get women because you call people bitches. That's just, it's kind of cringe. I bet like, I bet like when people hear that, they, they get icky about it. Like, ugh, that's kind of cringe. What? I, I shot him and one shot is enough to kill someone in hardcore. What's going on? What? Why am I doing no damage to them now? I'm just getting hit markers. I'm in hardcore. This is so out of place. I can't understand why it's now not like hitting one damage, one shot damage unless I hit him in the head. Hardcore is supposed to kill in one shot regardless. For a fact. Oh, apparently I've got to aim for the neck then, at least. Otherwise, it's not reliably going to give me the kill. I can't trust us. I can't trust my team. They're all walking this way, so now they're going to spawn over here. See? What did I fucking say? I, I literally said that would happen, and it happened. Well, I've finished the Mother of Pearl camo. I think I've just got the Bloodthirsty camo to finish now. Whether this will become a fucking stream long effort to get one more Bloodthirsty or not is beyond me, but I hope not. Ah, oh, I can't wall bang him, that sucks. Why is there so many of them? Oh, come on. Oh, we're actually winning as well. I just realized we've got the most flags. Or points, I should say. Whatever. Points, capture points, whatever you want to call them. You know, I'm surprised that I've actually managed to not have audio interference errors this whole time. And I'm using analog audio. Like, this is the thing. I used to have the audio constantly cut out randomly during the stream. Like, whether it be 30 minutes in, an hour in, it just randomly start cutting. It was never bang on the hour. So, it wasn't like a time-based thing. It was just random. Now, I don't have it at all. And I'm using analog audio, which is basically something you can use once you've actually managed to buy a, an Elgato chat link for... Hearing everything in your headset and you're hearing in game chat on stream. Like, since I did that, I've had no audio cutting, which is funny because it's almost like HDMI audio seems to have issues, which is weird because it shouldn't. I have the transferring processing or whatever it is for the audio to come for the stream on bulk, which basically makes it so that it's it's constantly fucking providing as much data per second as it can. So, it, I don't know, maybe HDMI is faulty. But I've not had any issues with um, analog audio as far as I've noticed. It's very rare at least anyway. Oh, the game ended. Yikes. And we win. We beat the, the, the sweats. See what I mean? The sweats aren't as good as they think they are at the end of the day. They might get the little replays like this because they get simple fucking kills. But they didn't play the objective and they lost. So this is what happens. You don't play the objective, you lose the game. We're not in team deathmatch every game, you know. So I mean, it looks like he's camo grinding, I'm going to presume. Because he's just literally using this non-camo weapon. We are past the two hour mark. So. Hmm. I say next match we'll finish this. So that means it's going to happen now. Surely, you know. Has to. Okay. Kill confirmed Do domination, yeah, because it'll distract them, I think. Having domination will be better for distracting them to go to the objective. I feel like Mother of Pearl looks better than the penthouse camo, and that one's lower down. It's kind of got like a rigid sort of crystal camo look, which looks really nice. 
I might try that one this game. You know, just to admire the camos. I never really have this one finished before the other ones to enjoy looking at it. Because it is a nice camo, this. It's like a a chrome, uh, like a blue chrome or something. It looks really nice. But I never ever have it finished before gold or diamond. So it sucks. Um, I mean, since I've finished that challenge now, I guess I can just put attachments back on. Have a field day with it. Uh, what else was I using? Quick draw, I guess. Aiming speed. Yep. Yeah. Um, FNJ for guaranteed kills. <laughs> no, not number two. I need number one on. No, not overkill. Number one. There we go. It's taking my pistol off now. Long barrel hybrid. Yeah, reload faster, increase ammo capacity. Oh, means I'm going to have to take Scavenger off. Sure thing, buddy. But my gun's going to be better now. Okay. I remember when I used to use this emblem all the time in 2019 or 2018. That was like my favorite emblem. <laughs> or it was it was that or it was this blue background one which had a hitman on it like with a gun it was like it was basically ajax i suppose with the um hitman sort of tuxedo suit on with like two guns or something something like that it looks really nice as camo i never really take advantage of using the mother of pearl camo because i always end up thinking oh the purple hex ones unlocks all the penthouse camera and they come afterwards down the list so that means they're higher rarity but no one fucking cares it doesn't matter they're all equally in the same camo selection option area they're kind of randomized they're not really like progression based i feel like they're not really progression based like the first set of cameras which are like headshots like number of headshots because if you had like the first camera selected on instead of the final one which is like red tiger it proves you've done led less headshots to select that less uh, headshot camo worthy challenge or challenge worthy camo in, in, rather than the newest one, which provides that shows that you've done more. So I feel like these ones, though, they're not really like progression based. They're just like random, aren't they? Like they don't really come in an order just because one of them's ranked placed higher than the other on a list. It doesn't mean anything. Come on. I love the noobs are everywhere. Oh, they fucking changed sides again. Of course. <laughs> of course they have. They always switch sides every damn time. Freaking ops. What's up? Let's have a look at... Oh, that's actually really nice. Oh my god, that's so nice when the light reflects off it. It sort of like moves like the glint off of it. Like it's um, like some sort of quartz or something. It's really nice. Like literally like a pearl. It's kind of trippy. Two. Can I get another one? Can I get a higher? No. Of course I don't want that. I don't want it off these weirdos. Uh, four. Oh, come on, teammate. Are you taking the piss? Oh, I literally had it. I had it. And you had to fucking ruin it with your team kill. It's always the teammates, bro. I tell you, I'm telling you. If it's not a sweat, it's a teammate. Three. Please. Woo! Woo! No! It's Marktage again, the dumbass who keeps using the Sorg. Hate these noobs, man. They're so obnoxious. Stop using these. I, like, again, teammates shot me with a sniper. Like, what's wrong with these guys? If these people can't be trusted firing their own teammates, how am I going to possibly get a camo done? It's just so fucking stupid.
Okay, Martage, we, we get it. You, you, we get your sauce. You don't need to tell us your sauce. It's, it's always him. It's always him on the other team. Look, he's just like... He's trying so fucking hard. We're not even sweating that hard back at him either, so I don't know why he's trying so fucking hard. And then we've got a camper. Brilliant. So now I'm going to camp to shut him down. Teach him a lesson. Come on. Where are you? Hey, hey, hey look, I've, I've got sweeties. C come and look. Come take a look. Stop hiding. I've got sweeties over here. I've got... Oh, he came out. Oh, my God. See, it must work. It must work. I've got pizza. I've got pizza. I've got candy. I've got everything you want. Just, just... Show yourself, please. I sound like a fucking, like, rapist clown. It's not a great... Not a great impression to make on people who join the stream. Right, it's just the Razor guy again camping. Nice. Oh. Two. Three. Four. Five! Let's go! It's over! Ah! Diamond camo! Tactical rifles! Woohoo! We got it! We got it! Gold camo! Nice! Spectrum camo? Nice! I'm never gonna use it though, because who fucking cares? Let's, let's fucking go, baby! We're not even winning, so I guess that's an excuse to leave. Oh, at least I'll only have like probably two levels or some shit to uh, do after I, uh... I didn't even realize, I'm looking back on the stream preview, I didn't even realize on my screen there was a migrating host thing. I actually left, which caused migrating issues. Well, yeah, screw you, Mark Tidge, you're going to have a laggy game where your game's going to fucking collapse because I left. Screw you. You're not going to bring me down now. Five more levels and I've, I've done. That's simple. Okay, so first we've got gold. As you can see. Very nice. As reacts. That's the three rap rapid kills. This is the four rapid kills, which is triple kill, theory kill. Very nice. Here we have diamond. Now, I really quickly want to show diamond on the other ones. So, here we've got the Orga DMR. Diamond. Oh, let's have a look at the stages. Five kills. 10 kills, 15 kills, 20 kills, 25 kills, and of course, 30 kills. Very lovely, the rainbow diamond. Then I have got, which, the next one, ABR223, diamond, here you go, 5 kills, 10 kills, 15 kills, 20 kills, 25 kills, and... The 30 kills. Finally, the lovely rainbow diamond here. And lastly here on the swordfish, we have diamond. Five kills, diamond. Ten kills, diamond. Fifteen kills. Twenty kills. Twenty-five. And then thirty. Rainbow diamond. Well, oh, it's going two different ways. That's kind of crazy. Um, that's probably my worst, my least favorite one of them all. It's the, the orange one. It just looks kind of gross, like vomit. Um, but yeah, so there's gold and there's diamond. We've done it. Let's go, baby. Um, so I can now select it on this weapon. Uh, what the fuck? I've got a death effect for this RK Garrison. I'm going to have to grind the pistols next. <laughs> Not looking forward to that. Um, so diamond's on that now. Is, what's with these random tea, tea bag attachments? I don't need that. It says I've got all these camos. I don't care. That looks like the royalty camo. I swear it does. It looks like the royalty camo from like Infinite Warfare, is it? Or is it Advanced Warfare? It's Advanced Warfare, I'm pretty sure. Um, 
I've got shotguns to do, actually. I might do shotguns next, or I might do the LMGs just to get them out of the way with, because they are kind of a pain in the ass. There is literally nothing here. I don't know why it says I need to unlock something for this. Um, so, yeah, um, that's really fucking cool. I'm so glad I've got that done. Um, by the way, the reason I have this gap thing here where, like, these guys, these ones are all dumped here at the end, and this one's here. This is the weapon I'm grinding. So, I put it at the first part of the area so it's easy to access. And then, once I'm done with the weapon, I determine whether I think it's worthy to use as an, a regular class after the camera grind, or if it's not one I'd use ever again. So, for example, the Swordfish is a very powerful gun, just like the ABR. So, I might just put it here as a class that I can use in the future with the secondary and good perks to use with it. But, yeah, so I'm working this way. So, the, the ones that are good will stack this way. And this is all the way at the start because it's um, a grind weapon. But, yeah, so we finished. That's that. That's Diamond Tactical Rifles. That's Gold on the Swordfish. Thank you, everyone, for watching. If you did enjoy, you can't do anything. Because this is the archive channel. But let's say you watched this let's say you watched all the way through. You could leave a like, but you wouldn't see it. But anyway, thank you everyone for watching the stream. And uh yeah, I will catch you all in the next one. Bye guys. <laughs>